Hello and welcome to Video Jug. This is Sick Dan Black Belt Steve Mortimer, and he's going to show you how to throw the perfect right and left hook. The hook is a vital weapon to any martial artist's armory because it allows one to attack the target from the side. Especially useful if your opponent is tightly guarded from the front. Step 1. What you'll need. It's best to have a partner to act as your opponent, preferably a fellow martial arts student. For the purpose of this demo, Steve will be practicing with his brown belt student, Marcus. And loose fitting clothes are essential to allow freedom of movement. Preferably a karate uniform, or more correctly, a gi. Step two, the stance. Start by standing with your feet shoulder width apart and taking a step back with your right foot to a comfortable distance as if on tram lines. Then turn your feet 30 degrees and bend your knees. Remember to keep your feet firmly on the ground. This is because all energy is drawn up from the ground. The energy must flow through your body and be released through your target via the fist. You can do this with a good stance. Step three, the hook. The key to a good hook is all in the use of body rotation. This will ensure you get the weight and momentum of your whole body behind the blow. And the faster the body, the faster the strike. Since the arms are naturally faster than the body, it's easy to cheat and throw with arm power only. But the arm should not be allowed to lead or finish the technique on its own. Nor should the body be allowed to move with the arm lagging behind. Make a note here. When punching, never be up on the balls of both feet at the same time. The transition from one foot to the other should be smooth and in tune with your strikes. A common mistake when throwing the lead hook is to drop your guard below the level of your chin. This must not happen as you'll open a knockout target for your opponent's counter strike. Keep your chin tucked down behind your shoulder. When the hook lands, snap your body back to the point of origin as rapidly as possible. Step four, breathing. Don't forget that correct breathing and the exhalation of your energy will improve your punching technique. Exhale throughout the entire execution of the punch. This exhalation should be strong and powerful and come from your abdomen. It's called the key eye. Here it is again. Beast. Step five, review. Let's see the whole punch again from start to finish. And remember, the perfect hook is a combination of a strong fist, a focusing of your energy, a solid stance, good hip rotation, and breath control. Now check out Video Jug's other guides to martial arts techniques elsewhere on the site. <laughs>